Welcome to the Large Scale Activity Recognition Challenge 2020. We're happy to have you with us in this fifth installment of our challenge. We have a challenge organizing team with a diverse industry and academic backgrounds. The general chairs are Fabian Kaba, Bernard Ghanim, Juan Carlos Niebles, and Kay Snook. The program chairs are Humam Alwasil, Victor Escorcia, Frost Cho, Ranjai Krishna, Shaimal Pok. We thank the organizing team as well as the guest task organizers for their hard work to ensure the success of this year's challenge. We also thank our sponsors for their generous contributions, Google DeepMind, Adobe Research, Google AI, and Kaust University. We have more than 12,000 US dollars in prizes. Video has become a commonplace in society. Its uses range from entertainment to communication and teaching. Thus, the learning of semantics representation of video has broad and far-reaching potential applications. We aim in this challenge to push the frontiers of video understanding. This year's challenge features seven different tasks. Two of them are based on the ActivityNet dataset. The first task focuses on temporally localizing activities, and the second on densely captioning video events. We host five guest tasks focusing on different aspects of the activity recognition problem. Each task is based on a recently compiled large-scale dataset. The first guest task is on object localization using the ActivityNet Entities dataset. The second guest task focuses on activity recognition using the Kinetic 700 dataset. The third task is on spatial temporal action localization using the AVA dataset. The fourth guest task is on activity detection in extended videos using the Active SDL dataset. The last guest task is on temporal action localization using the HACS dataset. Each participating team enters the challenge by registering on our website, where they provide details including names, organizations, and email. Each team is allowed to submit one entry per week for each task. Teams should generate results on the testing set by analyzing audiovisual content only. Training or parameter tuning on the testing set is not allowed. The use of external data is allowed, but should be reported. We received 218 submissions from 87 different teams. This year, we featured two new tasks. To encourage participation, we provided multiple pre-extracted ActivityNet features. We have also provided a toolkit containing scripts for downloading videos and evaluating the performance. Here we provide the schedule of our workshop. Please keep in mind that the times are based on Seattle's time zone. All sessions will be recorded and uploaded to our YouTube channel. Our keynote by Joseph Civic will be live and recorded. In the afternoon, we will have invited talks from three researchers from industry. These talks will be live and recorded. We hope that you will enjoy this year's challenge and thank you for joining us.